Hey, what's going on guys, it's Jonathan, and welcome back to another video. In this video, we're gonna be taking a quick look at a Bluetooth wireless speaker from a company that goes by the name of iClever. Now you can pick this speaker up on Amazon for about 30 bucks, give or take a few dollars, and it does come with free two day shipping if you are a Prime member. And with that being said, you can find that link in the description of this video if at any given time you feel like checking it out for yourself. On the back of the box, you're gonna find some detailed specifications and they advertise it as a five watt enhanced bass speaker and it does run on Bluetooth 4.0. Inside the box you do get a few things. You get an auxiliary cable, you get a micro USB to standard USB charging cable, you get your user manual, you do get a warranty with this specific Bluetooth speaker and you can see that warranty card right there. You just gotta go online and register it and then of course you get the Bluetooth speaker itself. So we'll go ahead and do a quick tour around the speaker. Starting with the front, you have the iClever logo and then a microphone for whenever you're receiving or placing a phone call and then a button with a Bluetooth and a phone logo. Of course, that's going to be how you connect the speaker to your phone and then how you answer phone calls. Flipping the speaker over on the back side is going to expose the micro USB port. It doesn't come with the wall wart, so you'll have to use the one that came with your phone or if you have an extra lying around the house. And then you have your auxiliary port and then there's also a notification LED light back here to let you know when it's charging and then when it's charged. The build quality on this thing is actually amazing for a $30 Bluetooth speaker. It's made of like a zinc alloy material, giving it a very glossy look. You can see it's super reflective, and I love the blue trim and the blue accents that they have on the speaker. Now, the biggest issue with having anything glossy is the fact that it's going to expose fingerprints like crazy, and this speaker is no exception. And it's also going to show scratches if you get any on the material a little bit easier than, say, something that was matte. But overall, it has a good amount of heft to it, and it definitely doesn't feel like it's going to break if you drop it. Another issue with the design of the speaker is the fact that the skip buttons, the volume buttons, the play and pause, and the on and off switch are all found on the bottom of the speaker. I mean, it's not a deal breaker by any means, but it's a little bit annoying when you have to flip the speaker over in order to skip a song if you don't have your phone on you. Now, there's also like a rubberized material on the bottom to ensure that the speaker doesn't move with whatever surface you set it on, and it works great. However, it is a lint magnet, as you can see here, but it really doesn't bother me since that's the bottom of the speaker anyways. So the speaker itself performs quite well, especially for 30 bucks. You're gonna get what you pay for. It's not gonna blow your mind away. It has a decent amount of bass, but it has more highs than it does mids. Here's a quick sample. So iClever pretty much says that you're gonna get eight to 12 hours of use with the 500 milliamp hour battery. And I was actually able to get between 10 to 10 and a half hours of use consistently. And that's not bad at all for, again, a $30 speaker. Now I have a Bose SoundLink, which cost me 200 bucks. And this thing is only $30 and it gives you enough sound to fill up an entire room. So I definitely recommend it if you're looking for a speaker on a budget. Well guys, that does it for me in this review. If you enjoyed it, drop me a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe if you're not already subscribed. Hit up the link in the description to purchase this, go ahead and follow me on all my social media connections, and I'll talk to you in the next video. Peace.